and welcome to Two Minutes of Anatomy. I am Dr. Donald Ozello of Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas, Nevada. On today's episode of Two Minutes of Anatomy, I'm going to speak about the subscapularis muscle. The subscapularis is one of the four rotator cuff muscles. To easily remember the rotator cuff, always think of the acronym SITS. S for supraspinatus, I for infraspinatus, T for teres minor, and S for subscapularis. Today's episode is on the subscapularis muscle. The subscapularis is a triangular shaped muscle. Its origin is on the anterior scapula in the subscapular muscle. Its insertion is on the lesser tubercle of the humerus and capsule of the shoulder joint anteriorly. Its concentric action is shoulder internal rotation. It is innervated by the upper and lower subscapular nerves from vertebral levels C5, C6, and C7. It also helps to protect the shoulder joint anteriorly and prevents anterior shoulder dislocation during shoulder abduction. Again, the subscapularis muscle is a triangular shaped muscle. Its origin is the subscapular fossa located on the anterior scapula. Its insertion is the lesser tubercle of the humerus and capsule of the shoulder joint anteriorly. Its concentric action is internal rotation and it also helps to protect the shoulder joint anteriorly and prevents anterior dislocation of the shoulder during abduction. And it is innervated by the upper and lower subscapular nerves from vertebral levels C5, C6, and C7. 